Tell me, is it now for him? It begins, that's all. How will it end? Oh, God knows. We swept through Wales. Complete coordination, complete surprise. Complete success. Yes, Father Proud. A few pockets of resistance. We'll soon clean them up. This is yours. A new name for your boy. Get used to it. So well in up, Griffiths. Education and retraining center 15. Come on! That's you. I'm Julia Clark. Ju That's the well enough, Griffiths. Pardon? Live, boy, live. At Camp 15, where over the next few weeks, you will all of you learn to live by the rules and the regulations of the Knights of God. Authority being present. 
Loyalty and obedience to the authority of the Knights of God in all things is absolute. Wait! March! Left, right, left, right, left, right, left, 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 right, left, right, left, right, left. Hey, you! Shift yourself! Go on! Shift! What are you looking at? Movement orders. You're joking, aren't you? You little Welsh git. I'm telling you, Sonny, pigs will fly before you see the other side of that wire. Well, you'd know about that then, wouldn't you? What did you say? Let me go. I just want an excuse, that's all. Go on. Group C to classroom six immediately. You will, and I'll be ready. Till then, I'm putting you on a punishment order. Out there. Group C to classroom six immediately. The year 2000, 20 years ago, a momentous year when the great revival in religious belief reached its climax. We now know that most Christians were very mistaken, misguided people. But it took one man to show us this. One great man. Our inspired leader, Friar Mordring. He saw that Christianity was a religion for slaves, for weaklings. And he founded a true religion. Worshipping a god of power, of strength, Vengeance. Griffiths. Griffiths, on your feet. Were you responsible for that row outside? No. No what? No, brother. I was not responsible for that row outside. I'll check on that. And you're late. Sorry, brother. I'm watching you. You know that. Now sit down. At the end of the 20th century, there was massive unemployment and a deep, bitter envy of the North for the South. This led to unrest and riots, violence, arson and murder in those northern cities. It was Prior Mordrin and the men who gathered round him who fought to restore law and order. And when the Civil War broke out, it was Prior Mordrin and his knights who defeated those forces of revolt and insurrection. Every day, you should go down on your knees, thanking God for that man. Power of the world, strong and mighty, fire-eyed and terrible. Long live the knights of God! Long live the knights of God! Be there in the roar of the battle, be there in the darkness of night. Give us strength to be brave in the struggle and souls to rejoice in the fight. Long live the knights of God! Long live the knights of God! Curse with famine, perish with sickness, blight, break, burn, 
all who stand against us. Long live the lights of God. 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 So humid. I can hardly breathe. Hmm. What did you say? I said it was humid. I'm not sleeping very well. These executions, they are having some effect, other than the drastic one on the people we shoot. Yes. At present, you could prove that. Well, things would be worse without them. But it can't be demonstrated. I have another list. It needs your signature. Always. Always another list. We will get to the end of them. When? They know the consequences. I swore to purge this nation. Not to butcher it. Please leave it to me, Father Prow. You have to be protected. There mustn't be one man in the whole of Anglia who would dare to stand against you. Not one man. And that's what you will give me? Yes. That's what I will give you. And a rain. Today's situation report. Wales. Again. We're getting on top of it. Are we? Yes, we are. Hostages have been taken. They'll be hanged. The lesson will be learned. We have taken hostages. They have been hanged. And the people hate us more. And they fight us in the Welsh mountains, in the wasteland, in our own Anglian cities. And it goes on and on. And it's not just the Welsh we're fighting. English, the Scots, and they all seem to be very slow learners, Brother Hugo. Next spring, our offensive will fail. As every other offensive has failed, we had enough fuel for armor, helicopter gunships, but we haven't, nor will we have. I'll sign this for you, but when do we run out of paper and ink and hang them? You are the prior, and I obey your orders. Take a look at this. Who is it? A portrait of your failure, brother. He leads the resistance in the Welsh mountains. Brave man. And clever. I would to God I had someone like him at my right hand. Well, now we know what he looks like. What? We'll find him. And? And we'll hang him. Publicly at Carnarvon. No. Owen Edwards. And he has a son. Well then. I want that boy found. If he's alive.
Get up. Come on, you Welsh git. Get up. Welsh git. On your feet. Leave him, leave him. It's off. Don't be so stupid. Future, keep out. There's no point in you being hurt as well. Thanks a lot. Has the elephant? Well, and don't make it worse. That's not my name. <sighs> Beer on tonight. It's homebrew. It's not bad. Looks a bit worse for wear, that lad. Yeah, they can't be more than 18, the pair of them. Fed up and far from home they are. Mind you, it was very chatty before he had his fifth pint. Yo. Easy walking, was it? Getting here? Oh, not too bad. Get him out! I'm not mopping up after you. Thanks. And hurry up, will you? Shouldn't be drinking, lads, like that. A lot of things they shouldn't be doing. That's right. Did you say anything interesting when he was chatting? Oh, yes. He said he was in a convoy, going through Sandberry's Pass in the morning. It's the first time they tried that for six months. It'll be the last. Pity. Yes. You sent a man through to the Bristol people. That's right. They've taken him. The Knights. He talked. They know who you are. to happen sooner or later. We knew that. I could get you out to our people in the wasteland. Mm -mm. No. No. What about Gervais? He's all right. But what's to come, he'll have to face, won't he? It's a nice name. Why did you change it? My father told me to. I don't know why. But listen, you must still call me Llewellyn, all right? Llewellyn. No, Llewellyn. Now go on, try again. Llew...
Okay, come on. Hold tight. Let there be an end to this. To send the convoy through that pass in broad daylight was lunatic. We have a garrison at Carnarvon. It must be provisioned, Father Prior. There's the sea. Boats. Are you totally stupid? All those vehicles, supplies. The men I'm not concerned about. They can be replaced, but the supplies, ammunition. I gave you an order. What have you done about it? The boy, Edward Sun, the terrorist. We have a computer working. We're running a check on all boys of that name in our education and retraining centers. That's not the name he'll be using. If you were Edward Sun and you fell into our hands, would you advertise the fact? Find him! Yes, Father Pryor. To report for inspection immediately. If there's any more fun and games for you, you'll be in here for another three days. Like that, would you? So watch it. Kate, hi. How are you feeling? Rotten. Three days in that place. How do I look? I've seen better. No, I've seen worse. Is it really bad in there? Terrible. They said you were coming out today. I've saved you some food. Great, have you got it with you? Mm-hmm. Anyone looking? No. Give it here. Food in punishment block can't be worse than here. Can't. Try it. No thanks. Well, if I can help it. Everything's worse. Yeah. There's rats. It's all open under the hut. And you can hear them. Scutter, scutter all night long. Don't sleep a wink. And the drafts. Freezing cold through the floorboards. Joking, that place? Don't stare. Tell me then, how are we supposed to get in there? Look, the point is, you get yourself put in there and then you get yourself out. Look, I've been getting up their noses since the day I came, but I've not done anything yet that deserves that place. And even if I did, there's no guarantee they'd put me in there. I mean, you might just quietly disappear. No, it's too much of a risk. It's a chance, Gervais. It's a chance. Look, I'll take my chances with the rest. I'm not afraid of that, but I'm not prepared to go with this. Then stay here and rot. All right. Say we take a gamble. And we're lucky. And we get put in there. How are we going to get out? Don't worry about that. Kate told me. I've sorted that out. And you believed her? Yes. You pull up a plank, you shin up the tower, and you're out. Llewellyn at Griffiths, Camp 15. Are you sure it's him? Yes, it must be. My helicopter now. Father Pryor, is that really necessary? We could easily arrange for it. Yes. It's necessary. I'm going to destroy you, my friend. Completely, finally, and irrevocably. <laughs> <laughs> 